go. First body extraction of my UDR. Flip it up slow. It's like a zigzag. You zigzag the front. Because I want to set it up on my radio that I have paired to all my others, I did need access. This will be my quick access rubber port to pair my receiver. And the other thing I want to do is just start reinforcing the body. I'm going to do a mix of Gorilla Tape Black and Gorilla Tape Clear. Gorilla Tape Black along the bottom edges that tend to strip out really easy and uh, and the rest try and keep it as lightweight as possible right on and there it is oh that's such an awesome looking rc really digging this thing still pretty much brand new i've just been enjoying some time doing some other things all right i've got my udr body shell all prepped I gorilla tape black that's the stuff with the mesh around all the outsides and uh, yeah, I'm quite happy with it. And then Gorilla Tape Clear, not everywhere, but all in here. This is all Gorilla Tape Cleared. This should be way stronger, last forever now. Uh, also, it means that when the, when the wheels rub, it can't abrade through the paint anymore. So it'll never get burn marks from the underside now. It'll only get burn marks if I'm scraping down the road on my lid. Gorilla Tape around all bolt holes. And, uh, I'm gonna run it on 6S for the first time because it's taking too long to charge my big 4S batteries and I'm running out of light and the sun is setting right now. So I'm gonna be running 6S, uh, two 4,000 packs. This battery tray is extremely small. I can do it with these little 3S's in. So there it is, connected, um, and you got to be worried about the wires. The wires have to be low. Even though these are using adapters, they're using the lowest adapters that I have. I'm just going to add a little bit of foam in here, uh, maybe two layers of foam. Foam in here, and then the battery tray. Can boom. It's latching system. Okay, that's open. Okay, and then latched, done. Ready to rock and roll. 6S power, here and we it's go. It's time to get the UDR out for its first run. This is very icy right now. It's, it's very crusty, very cold, very icy. We're just gonna see what it's like. Here we go. No traction whatsoever. It's so icy. It's so icy, it's got no traction. Just spinning like crazy. Traction. And maybe if I can keep my momentum up. Just gonna try and keep my momentum up. Here we go. Coming in. Full throttle. <laughs> That all it's got on full throttle, six S power. It's got a lot of wheel spin, so I don't think it's hooking up. Full pin. First roll over. Spinning, no, got no traction. Stuck on the ice. Nice donuts. Full throttle. Full throttle. <laughs> Yeah, you 
of this thing. about half throttle because uh, when I put the when I put the trigger full down it just spins because it's so icy. I think we just hit low voltage. So icy. Flush. Trump. If you enjoyed this, hit that thumbs up button. If you're new around here, subscribe. If you want to talk to me, leave a comment down below. And as always, thanks for watching. UDR, we just need some better weather, less ice, and this thing will be a ripper.